right, so today we'll be looking at what's this December. Why does chat keep crashing, bro? This restream crashed like 10 times today, dude. Anyway, December 2019. Flaskow, right? Flaskow. Um, Christmas part two, I guess. Uh, I can't spell it, dude. Okay, so. Things to note with this banner. I'm gonna go down to the things that you we wanna look at. First, we look at rate up characters. Rate up characters are, let's check here. Should be Naramea and Cyril, but I don't know who else. So we're looking at Holiday Naramea. Is it? What, 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 how do people, spell, how do they spell in GBF? They spell like that, right? Oh, Arlumea Orchid. Why? Oh, they screwed. Eh, it's a triple rate up. They got Arlumea as a rate up? Ooh, ah, that's a, that's a no bueno. how they do y'all like that? Halloween. Holiday, Narmea, Holiday, uh, Cerule, Holiday, Arlumea, and that's a lot of Mayas. Orchid. Okay. So we're looking at that for rate ups. So that means like that's like a 2% rate up, right? SRSN is rate up. New characters being these two get your rank. Um, no summons because Flaskal. I'm pretty sure the rate up is two percent, right? Not for two percent. Point point zero two. Excuse me. Let me look here. Oh, point zero three. I thought it'd be point zero two. Oh, okay, that's not bad. I mean, it's still, it's still like that's average rate up, so it's not, it's not that bad. I thought, it, I thought it'd be much worse, to be honest. But then again, I think the point zero two was on the um, summer banner. So point zero three on a, uh, that's average rate up, average rate up, in GBF. Unfortunately, <laughs> yeah. So let's go take a quick look at these characters real quick. First, let's take a look at their weapons because I don't even know what the weapons do. I already looked at the characters. Blade of Purification. Massive Earth Damage to a Foe. Boost to main character CA Damage to CA Damage Cap Stackable. It's like uh, a gold bullet, I believe, right? It's not full of brick bolt either. It looks cool though. Mm. Nothing special about it though. So that's whatever. So first looking at Narmea. Narmea Draft Katana. Oh, she should be melee, bro. Did she not hit that false force palm in the um in the cosplay, see Frost Palm somebody, dude. So, see, she was hitting people with her hands. She need to be melee, dude. That's what I think. Uh, massive Earth damage to a foe. Dodge tank counter effect to Narmea two hits. That's not bad. Um, getting counter on dodge tank counter for two hits on Ogi is not that bad. That's okay. Bonus period damage to the caster. If we know Narmea, I believe it's 80% on her scale one. Could be wrong. Um, generally, every variant of her is 80. So most likely I expect this one to be 80. She also gains dodge, tank, and counter for two hits upon using her scale one. 
That's definitely not that bad either. Um, she don't get hostility up, huh? Does anybody have her EMP notes? Does anybody have her? Does he have hostility up? Consumes thirty percent of charge bar. Oh, we have a cost. Consumes thirty percent of her charge bar. So it's usable turn one with the guild buff, but you can't just spam it all willy nilly. It's a two turn. Consumes 100% of the charge bar to extend effect duration. So she consumes 30 on the user, I guess. And at the end of turn, and I guess on the last turn, she will consume 100% of your charge bar? Can, can somebody explain to me this character? Cause I, I don't understand. Oh, because he does have hostility notes, okay. Yeah, her having a hostility makes it, her counter a little bit better. She has skill cap damage. She's a nuke. She only has... Oh, her skill. Oh, it's a nuke. It's not a buff. Oh, I thought it was a buff. I'm used to her skill one being a buff. That's why I said skill damage. Okay. But yeah. Okay, 3% if you have under 100. 100 if you're at 100. It lasts six turns if you use skill one at low, at 100%. Okay, okay. Hmm. Definitely need to see that in action there. It's 80%, right? On her skill one? It's funny because now Earth has a character that can drop their charge bar, which goes well with the upcoming Leviathan Malice that does not want you to chain burst. See what you did there, KMR. Release your Earth character that drops their charge bar. Watching you. Eight hits Earth damage to a foe, restores casters HP. Rages eight ways level. Wait, she got the eight gates? This is my guy? Rages eight ways level by two? Attack and defense are boosted based on eight ways level. Yo, she got the eight gates, my guy. What is going on? Mind at peace her skill three. Substitute effect to the caster. Receives all allies attacks, meaning skyfall. 99 damage reflection, meaning that Skyfall does 9 million damage. No, it's not 9 million. It's 999,000, right? How much is Skyfall? Wait, you can really abuse that though, can't you? Because if you lower her defense, well, she don't have a way to lower defense here now, does she? But if you were to lower her defense and use sky f and take a skyfall, you can get some pretty nutty numbers for her skill three, I think. I actually want to try that. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you; that sounds pretty fun. <laughs> like trying to, and you can do the cap. Oh, it take away my fun. Always take away my fun, dude. Always. Skyfall set damage. You can increase Skyfall damage. I, I've I've seen Bahamut, Ultimate Bahamut do way more than nine nine nine. Or maybe Ultimate Bahamut does more damage. But I've seen I've seen Baham I've seen Ultimate Bahamut do some like I think there was a one time when it did like seventeen million damage. I forgot who it's on though. There was a character that lowered their defense so much 
Skyfall did 17 million damage to them. That's what I remember. I don't know if Ultimate Bahamut Hilo was different, but I remember there was a character that lowered their defense so much that it did like, I think it was Yoda, but it was like 17 million damage. It was like, it was, it was a lot of damage. Also, she gets sharp boost to attack. So she gets assassin. Attack is boosted by falling mist. What's falling mist? Cannot be removed. So she gets substitute, reflect. Hold up. If the damage we receive reflects in 99% damage reflection, then does he take no damage? Is that, am I looking at that right? Is that correct or, or cause he wouldn't take, uh, that's how reflect works, right? Like 40% damage reflection, you take no damage, like 40% less damage, right? Okay, so yeah, he takes no damage. Okay, cool, cool, cool. cool. Just make it, sir. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, so she got, you can just hit her skill three all willy nilly, other than what, Ultimate Bahamut 50%? And even you can do it then because what, Titan? Cause it's Earth? So you can just be hitting skill three all willy nilly, huh? Bro, they releasing so many Earth units. I feel bad for Salt. They just keep release this year. They just keep releasing Earth seasonal, Earth seasonal. We got two summer units. We got a Halloween unit. Two Christmas units. Bro, it it sucks to be an Earth player right now. That's five units, five, and half a year. They released five Earth seasonal units in half a year. Five, five, that's a lot. Can you imagine being an Earth player, dude? I can't. Um. Anyway, another cooldown on her skill three, by the way. Earth is a wheelchair element. Earth is a good element. I don't know what you're talking about. I think Earth is in a good place. It just sucks at GW. Um, ten, ten turns on her scale three. Oh, you're so using the scale once per fight. It's a one hit. <laughs> you'll never. You'll never. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Well then, that's not nearly as good as I thought it would be. 10 turns is long. 10 turns? That's... That's a long cooldown, man. Um... When Narmea has counter effect, deal triple attacks... Oh! Raise 8 gates level upon countering. Boost to attack and defense based on 8... Uh, 8 ways. I keep saying 8 gates, bro. I can't help it. So every time she counters, she gains a level. She gains two levels from her skill two. And she deals triple attacks guaranteed when she has counter up. That's not bad. So this is pretty much two turns. Well, it depends, but it's like two turns of guaranteed TA, if not longer. Mm. Not bad. And then her, her Ogi, it's guaranteed two turns almost. I'm pretty sure it's the same thing as this. If she don't get hit, that is. No, that's not bad. Take a lethal hit without being knocked out. When eight ways level is eight, activate skill two upon being targeted by a foe. Oh, so she becomes Athena when she gets to level eight. But getting to level eight takes a while, my guy. That's a lesson. Each counter gives one, or is it counter per turn? If each counter gives one, that's not that bad. But if it counts the turn as one, 
that's awful. So, if she gains like two, if she can gain two in one turn from two counters, that's pretty good. If not, it's not so good. But yeah, right now it looks like she was just like a unit made for Levive the Malice. That's what that's what I'm looking at her as. Like a unit that, that's gonna counter Levive the Malice. So we don't we didn't give a date on Levive the Malice. We didn't even get to see the fight. But yeah, that's what I'm looking at right now. And let's go look at the other new character. Real quick, 10 minutes, bro. You know, listen, bro. I like to take my time and go through the characters, you know, look at everything. Forgive me, okay? I could speed run it, but I'm not gonna know everything. Shrewl, uh, Saber, da Dagger? Defense? When you get Dagger ability? Uh. Massive wind damage to a foe, shield effect to all allies, Typhoon Crest. Oh, he has an Ogi Typhoon Crest. Oh, you know he's gonna be a Crest unit. Wind damage to a foe, hit to attack, earth attack, and wind. Okay. You know, if it was any other Ellie, it'd be pretty good. But it's wind, so it's not that great. <laughs> this is how it goes. If it was any other Ellie, I'd be like, oh, that's really good. But it's wind. So it's whatever. Boost to all allies, multi attack rate, critical hit rate, and dodge rate. Ends upon taking damage two times. Wait, 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 wait. This is perma? This is a perma buff? So the whole party just gets, hey, Multi-attack, critical hit, dodge rate, just don't get hit. And he gets shield on, on Ogi, which is probably like a 2k shield. Thank you God he don't increase damage cap or anything. This is wind. Did that work with Monica? Did he build a combo with Monica or something? Right, that works with Monica, right? Cause dodge rate up, is he gonna like dodge, nuke? Right? Could I count the dodge, right? For Monica? It seems it seems, it's not this is not for racing by the way guys. Just letting you throwing it out there. It's not for racing. This is more for like I wanna solo some hard content I guess. But it's not racing. It doesn't increase damage cap, therefore it's useless. The straight facts doesn't increase the damage cap. So it doesn't make you hit that much harder either, probably. Just critical hit rate. So just throwing it out there. Unless it gains another buff. Like a damage cap boost, then we got something. But right now, this seems to be like something cute, like a little combo. Then we have 70% earth damage. Why are they doing this? Earth damage two turn. Oh, this is Lily. Right? That's Lily. Lily, um, Saruna. Yeah. This, this applies to all allies, so crest giver. Boost to all allies multi attack rate when not debuffed. Earth damage reduction to when allies based on their number of Typhoon Crest. Debuff immunity to when allies at the. Are you shitting me? You gotta, you gotta get this character. He, he, he gets debuff immunity in the back row. That's stupid. That's so stupid. Don't do this again. Just for the debuff immunity, out. That's the only reason to get him. You just get him for this. That's all you get him for. Debuff immunity. Is it one turn? He gets to your back row veil. Yeah. 
That's stupid. Can Fire get that? I hate being debuffed on Fire, dude. <laughs> can, we, can we... If if any Ellie was to get this, why'd it have to be Wind? You got Grimnir! Why, fire needs it the most! Look at Fire Veils! They suck! They suck so much! And be like, oh, no, they're Veil! Who cares? Who cares? It's not good. God, I hate being deep off on fire, dude. Yo, this is nasty, bro. <laughs> I'm just now thinking about this is pretty nasty, bro. Cause it's about to be on every Ellie. This debuff immunity to debuff immunity takes effect when he's the sub ally. That's crazy. They really give him Veil out for free now. That's absurd. Honestly, if you're a win main, you have to pick him up. You literally have to... If you're a win main, there's going to be a one... Whenever you play a quest with four characters in your front row, and if you ever get debuffed even one time, you're going to be like, Darn! If only I had him in the back row, so I didn't get this debuff. All it takes is one time. All it takes is one one time and you're gonna be annoyed that's a that's truly annoying now keep in mind when has Grimnir so you don't have to worry that much <laughs> let's keep that in mind when has Grimnir so it's not that game breaking but there's gonna be a time where Grimnir is not the unit you want to run you're probably like does that really exist? Yes, it does, actually. Fa high level solo does not run Grimnir front row if you have Katsu. The um four star the, the Arc the Oracle for judgment. So you run you run Grimnir back row. So that's the situation. Just throwing it out there, you know. Uh, that's about it for the banner, right? Covers everything. Now, just keep in mind, this doesn't imply every time, right? But the fact that he has something so special about him automatically makes him a worthy, a worthy unit to go after. Even though Grimnir, it's pretty much core in a lot of stuff. There will be a time where eventually you're gonna need this passive, dude. <laughs> it's gonna be a time. It's just a matter of time. If it not now, maybe sometime in the future. You don't have to spark him though. You can just any tick him. If you're a win main, just any tick him and then get on with your day. You don't. It's gonna happen eventually where you're gonna be like, ah man, was that that veil? This is a matter of when. Other than that, um, I think that's about it for this banner. Yeah. So what are we looking at? Narmea, honestly. My thoughts on this. If you want to spark for Narmea, you already spark for her anyway. Honestly, I I literally, you're going to spark for the titties if you like the titties. I literally can tell you nothing about this character that will change your mind, okay? Me talking is going to get nowhere with you. So, if you're going to spark for Narame, you've already done it. So, my opinion doesn't matter. You have to leave it like that. Narame, you already messed up. You already done it. You already done it. You already done it. So, uh, that's all I gotta say about Narame. As for... Cerule, right? Cerule. Grimnir exists, right? <laughs> Alright, so let's, let's do it like this. Grimnir exists, right? So. Sometime down the line, you gotta need this red, green fur. <laughs> 
け<笑><笑>
Am I forgetting anything? We got the we got the flask gal with the gotcha pen. The Jodex? Jodex? What what's the uh yeah, three days of roulette if you hold your roulette. I'm trying to I'm trying to feel like I am I forgetting anything? I don't think I'm forgetting anything. Yeah, two percent drop rate. Yeah. Hmm. I I don't I don't believe I'm forgetting anything. If I'm forgetting anything, we can just add it. But I think that covers that banner. And then we have this. The, January like fest legend fest part two with second part uh did, did they give a name for rat do we have a name for her I don't, I don't know if we have a name for her but we're gonna go our zodiac rat for now Possible We haven't had EO's rate up, right? We haven't had our rate up yet, right? Am I am I going crazy? We haven't had our rate up yet? Is that are they coming together, Mursami? Is Noah coming with her? Oh, uh, I thought it was a banner. Three new cats at the end of the years. Oh, so this so the the hellish person is is actually coming with Noah. Well, what's the name? Vakira. Oh no, Vakira is the name of um the rat zodiac. What's the name of the, the girl? Does he have a name? Okay. Thank you. What's the name of that one that, that the chocolate girl that was on What's the name of that oh man? Oh, so that's what her real name? Hello, Ben Saw. Okay, cool. Thanks, bro. Okay. Okay. That covers everything, I think. Possible rate of Zoe. Okay, I feel like we can make enough space there. Compare it, no, it's a, it's a skin. Compare it's gonna be a skin. Okay guys, how'd that look to you guys? That look, that look about right? It's gonna be a My Hero Rate banner too, by the way. I just want to make sure. So these these are the upcoming banners. If these things don't apply to you, right? Um, as I mentioned, Grimnir. I mean, Cerule right now probably doesn't have any use to be honest with you. But somewhere down the line, there's gonna be a situation where this, where this guy is gonna be needed. You know how they're doing this game. It's gonna be it's gonna be a content where you can't use Grimnir, and you're gonna need this guy. I can guarantee it. It's gonna be one eventually. It's only gonna be a matter of time. 
Isn't it dog? No, dog is going to come at the end, I believe. At the end of the month, dog is going to come. So what they generally do is that they're in the, the, the first beginning of the month, they give the rate up unit. The uh, the full minute break unit as well. Like if we go back right here, let's, let's go. Let's go back and take a look at the past. Um. So I believe the page twelve is what we're looking at here. Okay, maybe it's not page twelve. Where is? There we go. So the man we're looking at here is where is the damn banner? Here it is. This this is the banner? Here, Cumbera's banner comes with Cumbera, right? And Anila. Who got full break this year? That monkey? Right, monkey, right? Guess that right? No, wait. Who returned? It was my hero that returned, right? My hero returned. My hero returns, monkey gets full limit break. In this banner, we get Cumbera and Anulla. So what's the next banner then? The next banner at the end of January is... Is that gonna be my hero? And monkey. It's... So monkey's here, so where's my hero? Where's my hair then? What better than my hair came back in what? When did my hair come back? February? She came back? Ooh, that's long. Really? Well, the end of February, rather, right? This one? Yeah. Yeah, apparently. Was it always like that? Hmm. Let me see, let me see my eyes and I'm playing tricks on me, bro. <laughs> Was it really like that? Okay, let me look at the year prior to that with Anilla. Let's make sure. Get another trend on it. So it should be an it should be Anola comes back. When did Anola come back? So this is that man right there. So Vajra Monkey disappears in this banner. Yup, it is. And then Anola does not come back on this banner. And Anilla returned. Anilla returns. No, in this banner, Anilla returns at the end of January. However, my hero returned at the end of February. So right now, there is no trend for when dog will return no there is no trend on the full limit break character that's what I meant to say <laughs> think, it, think it's monkey
Is it because they separate fast and like fast? Oh, what the what their flask and light fest separated when Anilla got her full limit break? I don't remember if that separation came out that time. It's been too long. Maybe that's why Mozart. Maybe that's why. Hmm. Okay, I can't tell what Zodiac is gonna be, honestly. <laughs> I can't tell. I can't tell what Zodiac is gonna be. Honestly, I don't want to make. I don't want to make any promises. Cause I don't know. So we. I think we need one more year because we did have the split in 2017, right? That that's when we first had the split. So I can't. I. I don't want to. I don't want to send no info like that. No, no, I, we know, so dog, uh, chicken is already here, right? We know dog returns next, uh, this year, right? In 2020, but we're trying to figure out exactly what date will she return. So that's what we, that's what we're trying to figure out. Is he going to return on the very first banner, which is the ja January leg fest? Will she return on the February Life Fest or the March Life Fest? Don't know. Cannot I do I cannot guarantee right now, so. We'll we'll have to see, unfortunately. I can't guarantee that. Sorry, scamp. But um we're gonna call this a sh uh stream for today, guys. I pretty much covered everything I wanted to talk about. We looked at the characters, talked about the banner. Give, give my thoughts on if you want to spark this banner or not. Um, we talked about the upcoming banners. Looks good to me. I'm extremely exhausted. I'll upload this and I'll just go to sleep. I'm going to thank you guys for coming. As for my stream tomorrow, or today rather, I don't know if I'm going to do it or not. I'll probably post it on my Discord. I'll post it on Twitch uh, and Twitter. If I'm going to stream or not, I'm not sure though. But until then, um, hope you guys get all your hosts done. Good luck farming. Do know that we have to start farming these uh, Cosmos weapons. So that's going to be fun. I'll be farming it as well on my stream. So thank you guys for coming. It's 12 hours of me streaming too long. Till next time. Goodbye, guys. Later.